Haleluya. Eh ndi yabulisa ke bathandekayo ngelifika malenkosi o Christ u Yesu. Greetings to eh abantu anabakathixwa wherever they may be watching us from eh sebulise makhaya ngelifika malenkosi Christ u Yesu. Uh, welcome Matanegayo to another uh, Power Monday prayer service. Uh, if you can just drop a comment uh, just to say if the sound is audible enough. Unfortunately, I don't have another device to listen to, so I trust that Abazalwane are going to let me know if the sound is audible enough for me to continue eh ngele hlika malenkosi u Christ u Yesu eh i want to pray ke bazalwane before i go to the word of god and then when i'm done with the word of god pastor abs is going to take over and lead us to a session of prayer eh sa ubona ke if she is going to be live for that or we'll pray uh, depending keuba usemodini otanda zanga ntona mshanji if it's sensitive then we will pray offline but if it is not sensitive then definitely we will pray uh, together with you uh, before i go to the word of god if we can just start by praying and worshiping God in prayer and adoring God in in prayer and just dining in the presence of God with a short prayer in the name of Jesus Christ you are holy lord god almighty you are holy holy one of israel you are holy lord ungengenento Engolileyo ekhaya tixo wethu othandekayo emalanga Lord God Almighty as this day draws to an end as this prayer and fasting draws to an end we look back Lord to what you have done for us we look back to what you are to us we look back to your faithfulness O oh lord god almighty and we just want to say thank you we just want to say thank you we just want to adore you we just want to say beautiful you are oh god wonderful marvelous you are majestic you are lord god almighty as we lift our hands this afternoon O oh lord to the heavens Lord God Almighty and see you seated high on your throne Lord God Almighty with all the elders Lord giving worship and giving honor Lord God Almighty and the one that is seated at your right hand side Lord God Almighty we just want to join the worship in heaven we just want to join the praise in heaven to say unwele yehova wemikho si unxwele yehova siba wothi awufaniswe nalutho emhlabeni awufaniswe nanto on this earth lord god almighty we are privileged to know such a god we are privileged to be fathered by such a father for you are our father nana mhlanje emalanga we come before you Oh heavenly father in the name of Jesus Christ ukubanga bantwana bakathixo ophakamile enkulunkulu lo nto moya othandekayo inikeza impilo yethu and had that advantage just to know that we have been fathered by a god that sits and rule and reign above high in the name of Jesus Christ inkulunkulu sithi nanamhlanje ngalomvulo malibongwe igama lika Yehova malibongwe 
igama likankulunkulu ophilayo lord god almighty as we are going to the word of god i pray lord god almighty that you speak your heart to your people you speak your heart to me O oh god that wonke umtu olivileyo izwi likathixo impilo yakhe ingashiyeki injalo egameni lika yesu kristu wase nazareth ngoba aliweli emhlabeni libuye lingawenzanga umsebenzi for your word does not return to you void in the name of jesus christ without accomplishing that which you have sent your word to do in our lives lord receive glory receive honor in jesus mighty name amen and amen yes if you are watching just please confirm for me by dropping a comment that is sound iavagala as i have said earlier that the device and now your upper e1 le obugele kuyo so i can't even test and listen if it sound ya color so if we are live u pastor apps we jongile e phone nga chonjuba no pastor we have vagala you can continue please do that for me just drop a comment u chonjuba the vagala as i continue i am in the book of jeremiah I'm in the book of Jeremiah the book of Jeremiah chapter number 29 we are reading one of the famous verses that believers know for I know the plans that I have for you Jeremiah chapter is 29 verse I just want to start reading from verse number 10 and then verse number 11 then verse number 12 yes jeremiah 29 verse 10 11 and 12 verse 10 reads as follows this is what the lord says when 70 years are completed for babylon I will come to you and fulfill my good promise to bring you back to this place for I know the plans I have for you declares the Lord plans to prosper you and not to harm you plans to give you hope and give you a future then you will call on me and come and pray to me and i will listen to you you will seek me and you will find me when you seek me with all your heart i will be found by you declares the lord and i will bring you back from captivity lord this is your word your word is holy your word is true at all times tetangalo to yesu christu esetroneni yakhe and everyone says amen where we are reading from it is the book of jeremiah the 29th chapter o israel is in captive o israel ubanjiwe ithi i bible apasqala khona when 70 years are completed i will come to you and i will fulfill my good promise and bring you back to this place one thing i want to say and then we pray is that noma o israel 
waye tinjiwe for whatever reason but ise tembiso skatiko sasistile sasamile even though Israel was in captivity for whatever reason but ut utik emveni kweminyanka a70 i will come back for you and i will come and fulfill my good promise to bring you back to this place one thing you need to understand about the promises of god is that the promises of god are yes and they are amen nobu israel waya beta u israel wabanjwa aswe papiloni ise tembi iso skankulu nkulu ati utiko taiteta apa my good promise for you i will still perform it I want to say this Mazalwane that ungutiko esingamethemba ungutiko that we can rely on his word we can rely on his promises even when we go through things ezingabonakalisa ngongathi zingamenza uthixo angathembakali but utiko akubeleke athembakale if ndandi ngutiko at that time pastor apps ndandi ngazi usibona isizathu sokwethembakala to people abangathembakalanga kum i cannot continue to be faithful to people who are not faithful to me but god is of a different kind of you okokubana into and yethembisileyo even if you can go to exile leyo nto does not change the fact that i have a promise for you i want to say bazalwane uthixo uzawuyenza lento ayithembisileyo uthixo is going to come true for each and every one of us god is going to come good for each and every one of us utiko uzoyenza lento athe uzakuyenza that's number 1 number 2 in bible the reason why i am going to bring you back from babylon is that i know the plans that i have for you the reason why I want to fulfill my promise to you Israel it is simply because kuna lento ndiyaziyo ngawe I am glad bazalwane to serve a god onezinto azaziyo ngam noba mna ndingangazazi ezo zinto ngam at times but god knows the plans that he has for me to take a, i know the plans that i have for you now once kutetwe nge plan that on its own is big because i plan aingo mabona nde nzile yinto e shalwe ya shalwa ya tingwa ya tisaitwa ya sainwa it is something that has gone through a process of thinking and confirming and making sure that this is validated izinto uthixo anazo ngam nawe aizo zinto ezenzeka kuba sisendleleni but izinto ezenzeka by plan and by design i know the design that i have for you I know the plans that I have for you. Yabona ke Pastor Abs. I plan is gathi kongathi. Uyazazi yena. And uye wahlala wazicinga and he decided upon them. Wathi 
i plan and na yo lena ngosiban ban but ufumani sindobana usiban ban yena is not aware of that plan and akukonto as a person ubene plan obana i want to do this this and this and that for someone but lom to angati hold to the end yak of the bargain anga yenzi le okanye mhlambe ube ne plan endobana ngo 4 o'clock ndizamkhupha usibanibani xa ifike endlini ndiyomtisa out asuka usibanibani afone athi ndibambezelekile office nani zobuya ube wena sele uphukishile ube wena sele ubhatele because you had planned for this person you had spent money you have made calls uye wahlamba wanuka kamnandi wasithatha imoto ne heater ya all kwenza ndobana xa efika afike usibanibani yonke into imlungele because i have plans for him that's what god has for us mazalwane god has plans for each and every one of us and it is up to us bazalwane to get in line with the plans of god for the bible says inginga zethu azifani nezakhe nenendlela esenze nendlela zethu are not the same as his ways i am here to say this evening bazalwane let your will be done in our lives that's where i want to pray from that in turn lokathixo mayenzeke ezimpilweni zethu because i have come to understand that uthixo une plan anayo ngempilo yami and unfortunately at times i may not know what god has in his heart ngempilo yami but i decide ukusebenzisa la mthandazo ka yesu oti intando yakho mayenzeke iplani yakho mayenzeke icebo lakho malenzeke let there be nothing that hinders the plan of god in my life iti lengwadi for i know the plans that i have for you i know them yazi when we, when you leave apha emhlabeni and you watch izinto zingakwambili kakuhle ungaze dese ucinge into bana you are not important to god ungaze ude ucinge into bana mhlambe nothixo ukulibele but rest assured he has plans for you ut has plans they are plans to prosper you that's number one. They are plans to prosper you and not to harm you. They are plans to give you hope and to give you a future. Ungutito otingo uhle kodwa ngathi. Unemicabango emihle yodwa ngathi. And then verse 12 says then you will call on me and come and pray to me and i will listen to you you will seek me and you will find me when you seek me with all your heart i want to pray you will seek me and you will find me when you seek me with all your heart i think jeremiah 33 apo athi ndinqule ndinqule ndikuphendule ndikuqelele izinto ongazaziyo verse number 3 jeremiah 33 verse 3 call to me i will answer you and tell you great and unsearchable things you do not know unenginga uthixo anazo ngathi bazalwane and i have determined it in my heart pastor epso bana hey dicingba i plan zami zindibhidile intando kathixo mayenzeke empilweni yami dicingba ndizamile ngawamamandla 
di kingi lenda kingi sisa na kala ndenza but i have come to a determination eti and sakatalele ntongoku intando katiko mayenze ke empilwe nyam if intando katiko makes me cry at times but intando katiko mayenze ke empilwe nyam if it goes through a valley at times in tando katiko mayenzeke because i am deciding not to do anything else in this life but only the will of god in my life and how do i know what is the will of god for my life ndinule ndinule ndipendule ndikukelele izinto ezinqabileyo ongasaziyo call to me and i will answer you and tell you great and unsearchable things you do not know the reason why bazalwane we are persistent in these monday prayer services ingobana sazi indobana pastor abs kunezindu tikwa zazi yesingazazi if you can live life na mentality eti and it is imperative for me to know those things relax up until you know no man i want to tell you something apelwe a time ukoma nawo auna a time uhambo yoyithenga simply because you are being driven by the knowledge that there is something that uchomi anayo endi ngayaziyo noba lento it is going to destroy you but you want to know noba lento is going to build you you want to know it noba lento is going to make you smile you want to know it noba it's going to make you cry but you want to know it kune zinto utito azazi yongawe and you must be curious to know those things i am praying mazalwan i think i have i have made my point that number one utito kune zinto azazi yongathi and aizo zinto nje zizinto aziplani leyo Yabona pa emsebenzini xa uzoqala unyaka uba khona ukuthi waze strategic planning kuye ukuthi ibudget kubhukishwe indawo kubhukishwe hours uthenga ukutya ku update we calendar kuhlalwe phansi and we discuss and decide upon what we want to do for that year that's what god does for each and every one of us he knows the plans that he has for you ungutiko pastor abs that is concerned about each and every aspect of your life to the point that he has detailed each and every aspect of your life in his plans csi there is a, there, there is a, there is there's a plan that god has for us believers in the lord there is a plan that god has for you and as someone that knows into bana ku no mtu opeti plan ngempilo yam it odds long to into bana ingakunikeza rest up until you know that plan basalwane abantu abangakholwayo xa beyazi into bana ku no mtu ongandixelela ngempilo yam noba lo mtu ngicela inyani noma ngicela inyani benza sho into bana bakhweli baloyi baye kulo mtu lo ndawa kuyo bakhuphe le malo efunwayo if kuthoma kavuye ngothi ayohlambe manzini wanye mfuleni engancibanga wenza lonto because he is driven by the desire to know the plan for his life i so pray that we can be driven to go to go to know as is into tika zazio ngathi Uh, my, my time is up for i know the plans that i have for you and get njengomuntu on a plan 
ya bwana wena une plan wena that details everything about your life and that plan is with god wena ukwelcala ubona nje ba u5 e beta no 6 e beta kusisa and you don't understand ubana kwenze njani usibona nje ba kungeni inbox eh ku facebook umuntu abike inhliziyo yakho you don't understand your plan katiko ngempilo yakho now ndicela kube khona kwa 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 accounting ukukhona nokuthi wa kukureconcile ndicela ibe imission yakho to reconcile i plani ne reality because when you don't know i plan was a reality leyenzekileyo ngoku was present no past sometimes you past uke umlibale ndicela ke kube khona i si reconcile abazalwane with god yes ndicela sike sizame senze umtshato no tick sele tick i want to marry together with my plan hey what lord i want to reconcile together with my plan so that i know ukwenza ndo bana xa kusisa ngomso bena into i know that unengcinge izinhle ngamba i know oh bana you are going to do it lord i know that it has been done already lord i know that tomorrow i am going to smile i know that weeping may endure only for a night but i know that joy comes in the morning uben and that i know that okalile umsebenzi uzakufeza empilweni yam you can only live a life of assurance when you know the plan that god has for you if beni lapha beni zodi put your hands together and celebrate what the lord has said in your life in these few minutes Amen. God has a plan for us. God has a plan for you. I pray that you reconcile with that plan. I pray that you marry with that plan that God has for you. Father, this is your word. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Siyabonga tiko ngezwi lakho. Siyabonga tiko ngezwi lakho ulilizwe lakho wena uyiyo yonke into izwi lakho elithethayo uyalingqinela uyema ngakulo uligadile thiqe ukuba ulenze thiqe i pray that each and every one of us reconcile with the plan that god has for us as we have said to jeremiah that in ngole kuphendule ukuxela izinto ongazaziyo nezinqabileyo i pray that as we pray in this power monday prayer services that inkulunkulu continue revealing what you have for us continue telling us great things that we do not know in the name of jesus christ Kuluma moya oingwele pindu kulu umetito ube gati kangu tete ngoba we are being driven by the knowledge eti kunento utika na yo ngempilo yam kunento utika ya ziyo ngempilo yam kunento utika ya ziyo ngekusasalam kunento unento utika ya ziyo ngena pagatilam and i ought to know that which god has for me let your will be done on earth as it is in heaven in the name of jesus christ lord i thank you that you have a plan for my life thank you lord that your plan is to prosper me thank you lord your plan that is it is not to harm me thank you lord that uneninga ezinhlenge empilo yam plans to give me a bright future in the name of jesus christ i pray lord that whoever that is listening to this prayer and listening to this sermon may you reveal the plans that you have for them in their lives as they continue seeking you with all their hearts 
ngoba uteka sikufuna ngenhliziyo zethu zonke siza kukuthola thixo uthe masi unqonqoze sovulelwa uthe masi ufune sofumana uthilo kulunkule zwini lakho wathi masi cele sophiwa in the name of Jesus Christ ulunkulu ulunkulu Thank you so much. Thank you so much Lord. Just to know ba we as tick as as plans on us on below zethu. In Jesus mighty name. Amen and amen. Hallelujah. I'm we're just going to pray bangcele together. Um, for the next 15 minutes or less eh ngeke bathanda kayo si sinelibazise amen i urge everyone that is at home to pray in their own space i urge everyone to get to their knees if it's possible and we are going to pray and sell this word to work for our lives hallelujah tikona mhlanje uthi in verse 13 and ye shall seek me and you will find me when you seek me with all of your heart and this is an assurance bathandekayo that asimkhangela uthixo sizomfumana and when we find him oh he is going to tell us exactly what is in his heart about our lives when we find god he is going to start to unpack what he has called you for when we seek god and find him he is going to draw us to his plan for our lives in the wonderful name of jesus as a city beneno tiko everything else is going to be clearer nendlela ubukade ungayiqondi uhamba kuyo it's going to be clear whether you should continue in it or not uthixo will start to make everything clear to us only when we seek him and find him i'm finding so much comfort tonight in knowing that when i seek god i am sure to find him this is comforting so much because batandekayo when we are journeying in the life of salvation as we are going on and trying to live this life out we we, we need to know that when we seek god we will find him and it is so much comfort in my heart namhlanje to know that unguthixo ofumanekayo kwabo bamkhangelayo unguthixo ofumanekayo kwabo bamncanelweyo unguthixo ofumanekayo kwabo babeka yonke enye into ecaleni and choose to focus on him and so tonight i want us to pray and say that father as we are going to find you surely we are going to hear about izinto that you are going to tell us we, i want us to pray bangcele that when god starts to speak to you that lento ayithethayo uyimamele and uy because there is power in hearing the word of god but there is more power in hearing and doing the word of god and your breakthrough is going to lie in you doing exactly what he tells you when you find him father in the name of jesus we come before you we give you honor we give you praise uhleli esihlalweni sakho sobukhosi uyalawula yonke into esezulwini iphethwe nguwe yonke into esemhlabeni ilawulwa nguwe thixo wethu onamandla onke nathi bawo wethu oyincwele siyava namhlanje and we've always known thank you for reminding us that kahle kahle impilo zethu zifihliwe kuwe impilo ze to oh nkulunkulu wethu onamandla onke i laid before your eyes ayikho into thixo wethu oyincwele that is concerning our lives efihlakele okuwe thixo wethu onamandla onke yonke into yethu ibekiwe yadlalwa phambi kobuso bakho and this is giving us confidence emalanga to trust you ngoba wena uyayazi indlela ngoba wena uyayazi into 
ezo kwenzeka ngomso yayazi into ezo kwenzeka kulonyakuzayo yayazi into ezo kwenzeka in 10 years to come we have no reason not to trust you bawe to oyinxele thank you spirit of the living god for reminding us namhlanje kasenza kakuhle xa sithemba wena senza kakuhle xa sincike kuwe ngoba uyayazi indlela esizoyithatha ebomini uyayazi we will ultimately end up our father and so in the name of jesus this evening We are coming before you O Spirit of the Living God and we are saying that we are seeking you O Father with everything that we have we are seeking you with everything that we have we are seeking you with all our minds we are seeking you with all of our hearts we are seeking you with all of our spirits everything in us is seeking you O Lord everything in us is yearning O Lord to tap into the plan that you have for our lives everything within us of father is yearning kulungulu wethu ona mandla ukuba sihlangane kunye nawe endaweni yakho yokuhlela izinto kulungulu wethu oyincwele we are choosing to partner with your plan namhlanje emalanga we are choosing to marry your plan we are choosing to align with your plan in the wonderful name of our lord jesus Because father once you are aligned with your plan if in our journey to go to ona mandla there will be nothing that will surprise us on the way and even if there are things to go to ona mandla esithi xa sihlangana nazo zisothuse god you are to go to ingcwele kuzo sala into yokuthemba wena kuzo sala our faith in you kuzo sala our trust in you go back to go to ona mandla you will show us the way and you will lead us in every step of the way kulungulu wethu oyincwele thank you for the assurance tonight oh that you know the plans that you have for us we are born at go wethu ona mandla yonke le nto esigqitha kuyo god why you are saying tonight that csi i know the plans i have for you and when things may not be easy but i know the plans i have for you ewe kungabanzima endleleni ningayiboni noba nakuyasa noba uyahlwa but i know the plans i have for you and so for that reason alone you want to seek me for that reason alone you want to seek me for that reason alone you want to cry to me for that reason alone you want to call unto me for i know the plans that i have for you father thank you that you have a plan for this church thank you that you have a plan for each and every member of this church despite everything that you are facing oh father despite all the hardship that you may be encountering on the way despite all the challenges that you may encounter on the way but father we want to say thank you for the reminder that you know the plan you have for us Oh, and father your plan is to is not to harm us it is not to harm us oh father and we thank you for that we thank you that your plan is to give us hope we thank you that your plan for us is to make us prosper in the wonderful name of jesus we thank you so much father and you are praying kulungulu wethu ona mandla that xase sikhona sibizwa ngoba singabantwana bakho kungabikho nanye nkulungulu wethu oyincwele into esecebeni lakho esiphosana nayo make us aware nkulungulu wethu oyincwele sharpen all our senses ulamaya yendele bosha khayanthela bosha sharpen all our senses oh spirit of the living god so that nothing in your plan passes us 
sharpen our senses oh father open our eyes so that we may see all the opportunities that you are bringing our way as according to your plan oh father sharpen our ears so that we may hear all that you are saying oh father concerning our future concerning the plan that you have for us sharpen our senses oh lord so that nothing in your plan misses us sleeping and slumbering father i declare and i decree that each and every one of us is starting to awaken to your plan is starting to awaken oh father every sense that is within them so that they may perceive what you are doing in their lives in the wonderful name of jesus every plan that you have you have put out for 2021 we are not going to miss it oh lord and every plan that you have set out for 2022 we are not going to miss it oh father we are sharpening our senses we are declaring that our senses are sharpened in the name of our lord jesus christ father i'm praying for a spiritual awakening to anyone that was sleeping on themselves in the wonderful name of jesus we are you are sharpening all our senses. We are kabuza. We are paratile to inchisaka lo yokanya lugu sobako. We are kabuza. We are paratile to inchisaka lo yoku kala guwe. We are kabuza. We are paratile to inchisaka lo of calling upon you concerning the plans that you have for us. Kulunguluwe to ona mantra. Well, no matter what the devil had planned, kulunguluwe to imwele. His plans are becoming null and void right this moment in the name of Jesus because Lord we are opening up ourselves to your plan and your plan alone for our lives in the name of Jesus and there is no devil in hell that shall distract us anymore there is no devil in hell that shall derail us anymore there is no devil in hell that shall make us lose our way in the wonderful name of Jesus everyone to go to on a mantra is awakening of father and they are just sharpening their senses in the name of jesus father this is this is your church this is your work we are rededicating it to your hands according to your will of father now which are declaring tonight that you have a plan for it we are just dedicating it into your hands we are placing it into your caring hands not to see us a young get to go to on a mantra say full as a pin we beg as and then zako going to go away to a email i am praying father for every member of this church and for everyone that is crying to you going to go to one on a mantra on a seeking your face i pray that you fulfill your word and that you let them find you and when they find you i pray that you begin to unpack exactly what is in your heart game pillow zabo Thank you, Spirit of the Living God. Because sometimes we feel like there's no plan. We feel like we're all alone. We feel like we're just fumbling through life. Thank you for your word that comes to our hearts and revives us. Thank you for your word. Father, we pray that every word is a value of the Lord. If you are in the world, you are in the world. 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 Sing our Bali every day, Sivuk, and to go away to Onamanja and apply them in our lives as we are working with you. Kulungulwe to Onamanja, we are trusting in your counsel, we are trusting in your guidance, we are trusting in your direction. September, to go away to when I was gong and Kulungulwe to Ingwele, Sikokele to Alaletu, Sikokele Tembegile, Sikokele to go away to Onamanja, usher us into the best versions of our lives usher us into a space that we have not even imagined usher us so oh father into the space which you as god predestined long before we even existed 
even before you knitted us in our mother's wombs you knew us and it only makes sense for us to trust you because you know us even better than we know ourselves you even know the number of hairs in our heads we have no reason not to trust you we bless you lord for the work that you're doing here bless you for the work that you're doing in each and every one of us we love you so much and we adore you in jesus name we pray amen um siabulela ke bancele for joining us um it is my prayer that we continue to pray and seek the face of the lord during the course of the week eh siambe no thixo sincokole kunye naye sihlale kunye naye ya asixelele izinto esingazaziyo nezinqabileyo may god continue to bless you we love you so much and may you have a blessed week may you have a productive week and may god show up for you and may god answer your prayers in the wonderful name of our lord jesus we can just samkele ufefe and then call it a day may the grace of our lord jesus christ the love of god and the sweet fellowship of the holy spirit rest and abide with us now and forever more surely goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives and we shall dwell in the house of the lord forever and ever amen hallelujah